American Music Awards. The American Music Award of Merit is presented to Kenny Rogers, January the 17th, 1983. Thank you very much. I may look foolish, but I feel great. I, uh, I just want to say there's a book called Passages that deals with uh, crisis moments in everyone's life. And a crisis moment is defined as something that once it happens, your life will never be the same. And God knows I've had my share of those. I may have another one right here, as a matter of fact. But it uh, feels awfully warm down the back of my neck. You don't see Surely not. He wouldn't dare. No, but there are certain people in my life that definitely are crisis people, and as far as I'm concerned, that have changed my life in such a positive. What's that? What? Dead. Dead. That's right. <laughs> so I'll take just one quick second, if you don't mind, and thank uh, the young man who really turned everything around for me, Larry Butler and produced uh, all of the first things that I had, and he's a tremendous friend and a good person and very important to my life, as a matter of fact. So I say thank you to Larry Butler. Also to, also, yes, son, I, I know who I am, thank you. Uh, <laughs> Lionel Richie, again, I can only say thank you to you. The, I think the most beautiful song ever written, Lady. Is. Two other people that I feel made this very, uh, very important and very possible for me. Ken Craig and my manager who's been with me through all the peaks and the valleys. Believe me, I appreciate it. And my good friend Jim Mazza, who's the president of EMI and now the president of Capitol Records. Without him, I, I assure you, none of this would have been possible. Jim, wherever you are, thank you very much. And to you people at home and you people here in the uh, audience tonight, I assure you, this is a very special moment for me, and there's another saying that trophies are only important if you have someone to share them with, and as far as I'm concerned, I share them with all of you. Thank you very much.